Okay, Jimmy here. Uh, I'm on OS Maps. So I got this as part of like a one year bundle <clears throat> in regards to my birthday that passed recently. Um, so I'm just, I mean, I've done a video already on Call uh, on Google Earth that was primarily showing like the island itself and like pictures of it and everything, but like. The one, there was one thing I was kind of, cons well, not concerned, but, like, I was kind of interested in, like, the, the sort of paths and the roads that you can go on the island. So, for example, I'm just going to zoom in to, like, where we're going in a couple of months' time. So, or so for, like, for example, Auburn, which is there. Is that going to load? Yes. So you see how in depth and detailed it is. <clears throat> I'm new to the maps. I mean, my dad's a a whiz genius with it. I'm still learning it. Oh, there we go. It's loading a bit more now. Just needs time to load. I'm used to using Google Maps. I'm used to using my Strava and my like my other stuff as well. My sports tracker as well. But it doesn't show you like in depth like this. Of like what's where because it just shows you like the paths but uh, I'm gonna go so literally we're staying in is it Ardchur there's a there's a place called Eriske which is an island oh Lismore's not too far away from here there we go Eriske which is here you can potentially I think that looks like it'd be cool if you could get a, a ferry from there to here. Um, but where is it? Ard Church, which is up here. There we go. So we're staying here. This isn't until like May. But it kind of gives you an idea of like what's where the contour lines of how steep the hills are or like what's where but really i mean i'm gonna i'm using this for like here but i'm gonna zoom back out because the idea of lismore is there which is cool so for me to do coal uh i had a real i kind of had a good idea because like I checked, when I checked the hotel, booked the hotel, I just recently decided to be like, do you know, I'm going to message the hotel, see what time the check-in time is, and the check-out time is. So the check-in time is 3 o'clock in the afternoon, but I don't get to the hotel, for I don't get to the island for like 10 o'clock in the morning. So I was kind of like, wow, that gives me loads of time before I do have to check in and then the room is ready but then I kind of had an idea so before that really did so, so from going from that to this it goes from open and I'm going the wrong way am I? yes I am <laughs> open go this way go along here and it goes to call and literally the ferry gets to drops me off at this pier bit here. It just it literally has the arrow and it says pier. So there's pottery there. Here's that's interesting, it does it shows you every sort of tiny detail and it's very well detailed. And the contour lines of the roads. Um paths. So I had an idea. Could drop my bag off at the Coll Hotel, rent a bike, and my idea is just to ride around the island for like an hour or two, um, and then have then drop my bike off, drop the bike off. Because literally, you're gonna you're gonna see more being on a bike than yes, and I'm like yes, it would be cool to walk from this arena go. All the way down here to the dunes. 
and then down here to this point. But thinking about how much more you can cover on a bike is kind of in the question. Because you can do whatever you can on, you can do loads of this area on bike, on the bike in anyway. And then you can just put the bike back after being like, yes, I've done with the bike. And then you can start walking around like your local area, this local, like a really your area. Particular show hotel. It's gonna. It's literally here. Here or it's post office, school, cycle hire, right there. M M L is memorial, I think. Quarry disused. Cycle hire there. Cycle hire there. And then the one thing is like with here. All this bit, there is no like paths on this side. Don't know what that is. There's some sort of settlement there, you see. The Canada there. See, the problem is a big chunk of that island is not walkable. I mean, you might be able to, if people are aware, if you, if there's some sort of path that means you can go through it, then yes, but, like, it's easier to just walk this way. Oh, there's some windmills there. The golf, is that a golf course? Looks like it. Whew. There's a little village here as well. Tiny village. Oh, nice. Sorrisdale. See, being on the bike, you can do more. And I'll be like, let's just see how much of the island you can cover while hiring the bike before checking in. Because I'm like, yes, it would be really nice to walk around the majority of it. But you're going to see more of it being on a bike. For sure. So, yeah, as of now, um, OS Maps on Isle of Cole. Just showing other stuff as well. So uh, thanks for watching and goodbye.